Hi, today I'll be showing you the Siemens SN277W01TG freestanding dishwasher. It's the IQ700 model and it's one of the top of the range models in the Siemens range. Now the first thing we'll notice on the front, compared to a lot of other dishwashers, is how clean and simple it looks on the front. So if you have got a row of appliances, then it's not clustered at all. So as we open the door on this dishwasher, the first thing you'll notice, apart from the nice big screen on the front, is you have got a screen in here as well. If you press the on button on the left hand side, then first of all it shows the brand and now it's telling me to add the salt. Obviously I've not put that in yet. But apart from the brand logo on the front, inside it will actually display the settings for the different programs. So first of all it will tell you the time at the moment. I don't know if you can see that, that says 7.52 and for each program it will actually tell me what time it will finish. So as a quick rundown of some of the programs first of all on the left you've got what they call auto programs and what these will do is it gives you the option to select the temperatures but it will actually vary the amount of water and the temperature for each program depending on how dirty the water is. The next one is the eco so if you're not in a rush then just select that program because it can be slightly longer but it is more efficient uh, you've got another option which is the night program which again is a longer program uh, but what you do find is with some longer programs they are more efficient then you go into some of the higher temperature washes like this one which is a 65 degree wash so if you are washing things like pots and pans then that can make quite a difference as you move to the right hand side then you have got different options first of all you've got the time delay option so if you want it to come on when you're out or during the night then you just use that button there a couple of other really good features this one is called various speed plus so for this program at the moment which is the eco at the moment it's 755 and it will finish at 1110 so it's quite a long program but what you can do is if you press that button that's just shaved more than an hour off the program and basically what it does is it just shortens it it doesn't mean it's quite as efficient being the eco program but it does mean the wash gets done a lot quicker so once you've selected the program that you want then you do have to press start on the right hand side there as it says there it says please close the door and what it does is that will show you on the front which program it is and for a moment there it did tell me the temperature that's it and that's the anticipated time that it will finish so it's a really nice full colour display that's very very useful as we move inside the dishwasher you will see that compared to most other dishwashers there's a couple of unique features first of all we've got these blue lights which make it look very nice second one is this cutlery drill so with the cutlery basket this is really designed so that you can put individually all of your knives, forks and spoons. You also have the option on both sides, if you click this, that that will reduce the height of it. That's mainly if you've got very small like espresso mugs. And then you just pop it back up there. This basket can come out, so if you want to remove it to take it to your drawer, once it's been cleaned, then you can put it back in. Basically you just lift it out, like that, and then when you come back, just locate it on both sides, then that pops back in. As with the majority of the Siemens dishwashers now, they have this section here, and this, first of all, it can be used as a handle, but that's not the primary objective of it. The main objective is you've got the section here, which is where you put the tablet, so part way through the program what will happen is the tablet will drop out of there into there and the main advantage of that is that it won't get caught in a cup or a bowl or anything at the bottom so what it will do is it will dissolve every time during the wash. Now the top basket is very well designed as well all of these at the top they can be reduced so you just push those down 
and the main advantage of that is it can create a large surface area so if you have got big bowls or pots and pans then it makes life a lot easier for you. What you've also got which is a very good feature on Siemens dishwashers is something called Rackmatic and what that means is it gives you the opportunity to reduce or raise the height of the top basket. You've actually got handles on the side here and all you do is you press the handles in and that gives you the option to reduce or raise the basket. What you can do is you don't have to do it both sides. If you've got say tall glasses at this side then you can just press one handle and then just reduce it like that. It still washes perfectly every time. Now the bottom drawer as we open it, very similar to the top where you can actually reduce all of these down so these can fold flat that's very easy to do and again the advantage is that it creates a nice area so you can put your saucepans or big dishes and all of this section can reduce as well you've also got that so if you have got bowls that you can't fit down here then you can put those on top as well now what is also included with this dishwasher is the wine glass holder this is a great feature, very simple. All you literally do is to put the glass on here, the stem slots into there. Once it's located, just twist it and then that drops down and that will hold that in place. And then all you need to do is at the bottom fold down some of the racks, put that in there and then it will clean them perfectly. The main advantage of using this as opposed to putting them in the top is in the top it can be a little bit limiting with the height and then after you've finished once you take them out and it will have dried perfectly just raise that up and then twist it and you can take the glasses out now general maintenance on this dishwasher is very easy all you need to do is if you pull the basket out and just put that to the one side first of all on the left hand side you've got the salt container you do need to use proper dishwasher salt don't use table salt as some of our customers have done. What you can do to take the filter out, just twist that. That comes out, that's ever so easy. It is made up of two parts, so you can take that apart if you want to clean it. Just rinse it under water and pop it back in. With the spray heads, if you want to clean these, these are easy to take out. The bottom one just pulls out and you can clean that easily just pops back in. With the one underneath, it's not quite as easy but you literally twist that and then that drops out. And then again to put it back in just twist and then it goes back on. Now when you're connecting the appliance you'll see that you have this device. This is what connects onto the cold water feed as all dishwashers are now. And this is called HydroSafe. It's basically a leak sensor so if at any time there's a leak within the dishwasher then it will actually alert you on the front panel and this is a great device that is included with this hope you enjoyed the video on the Siemens SN277W01TG please give us a thumbs up on a YouTube video if you've got any more questions or if you'd like to order one of these dishwashers then visit the link above thank you very much